less than 100 miles from New York City is Plum Island Lab. Here, the U.S. government conducts top secret biological experiments. Most Americans are unaware of the facility, but it has been linked to an Al-Qaeda plot and an alarming past tied to Nazi scientists. Military technology expert John Gresham has been denied access to the island. Now he decides to view the lab from the air. Once airborne, it takes less than two minutes by helicopter to get from the tip of Long Island to Plum Island. Along the south side of the island are the abandoned ruins of the original lab run by the Nazi scientists. It now appears to be crumbling at the hands of the elements. It's interesting how the government just abandons the things they don't really want, but the stuff they do want to take care of, they really take good care of. Then they approach the main lab. There, John can see the measures that the government has taken to keep the facility secure. Well, you can see how much they've expanded since 1950. The very large receiving and storage facility over here, which they're clearly using very actively. John is left wondering if Plum Island is really the best place to keep a potentially dangerous facility. Back on the ground, John analyzes the video he shot. This is a vulnerable island. It needs to be looked at, and perhaps the facility moved. The government does plan to move the bioresearch lab to a new facility that would be built in Kansas, but the plan has been stalled. In so many ways, this is not a facility that folks in this densely populated part of America should be forced to live next to. For now, Plum Island will remain open indefinitely. The danger of exposure to locals remains unchanged.